Hello, welcome to the video. So we're back here again with another monthly account update. This guy is still uh, trying to get the fruit flies. I'm trying to get the 1 million fruit flies in your storage chest achievement. Taking quite some time, mainly because he's terrible. But yeah. Other than that, it's not doing anything special. Just keep catching stuff. He's now level 56, which good luck, Maestro Man, to catching up to that. Swing Block is currently farming these guys. I want nugget cakes. Eventually, he will go back to mining. Since I'm on uh, swing block here, let's actually replace some of these construction obols. I think they are useless. Correct me if I'm wrong, but these only work when you're active, right? It's going to give you a bunch of strength instead. Well, that's good enough for now. Maybe most importantly, this guy is carrying the Blunder Hero trophy, which gives him 3% skill AFK gain, which will be helpful when he goes back to mining. Hookstaff is just farming the Snell Bees. I was meant to put him back into shopping a bit to level up to at least level 50. But then I saw he had this stink axe and yeah, this thing is not good for shopping. So for now, I will just keep him as a farmer or something. He still has the train and cooking build on, but I never use it because this guy is pretty active. You know, you're supposed to be using these things when you are killing stuff quickly with him. I don't like playing shamans, even though they are the best at killing the Colosseum quickly. And pick an axe, the hero we all love. Got a new hat? Wait, where is it? It's on his head? But here is something else. Hmm, how strange. That's right, the red boat is a premium hat. You can wear two hats at once. I have not upgraded it. You can see here, the stats change. So both hats are in use. He got 2.3 top damage right now. Pretty good. Other than that, he's just doing the same as always. Sometimes he kills a boss, sometimes he doesn't. Most of the time he's just farming here at the ram. He's trying to get uh, this one in one million ring. I got my first ring at 1.1 million. So yeah, that's what you call unlucky. Even with 2.8 drop rarity. Seeing Hunt is just farming the circles. Well, we didn't get any to show, but these things with the circle, because why not? Might as well. I think they are pretty useful to have. He's also just collecting everyone's traps. Secret Claws have a bunch of bunny traps. I don't really want to mess too much with the traps until World 4 comes out, because then we might have a remote way to do this. We shall see. Barber Thumper is useless as always. He's only level 44 in shopping as well. This is what we call pathetic. He's supposed to be doing this for worship power, but yeah, we keep forgetting that. So he's just farming the Snell Beast. Secret Claus is now shopping in the palm tree while leveling up his shopping. He's 54 right now, so that's not bad at all. Wasn't that the level I said he would never beat? Oh no, that was catching. Right. Yeah, you're never gonna beat that. But I'm getting tons of thick skin statues. If you don't know what to shop, then you should really shop this palm tree. It has great drops. You get thick skin statues and lots of pens and stuff like that. Twisty leaf. You got a platinum pickaxe and a Dementia Dicer. And you got the natural traps. Five out of four placed. And you got a crappy skull though. So 54 at that is highest. Oh, well, I don't count these two. So he should probably go fishing or, you know, that one soon. But we shall see. I have to make new tools for him then. That's not going to be fun. And here's the main shopper himself. 68 in shopping. He's a monster and he got all the gear as well. He didn't want to share that with uh, the Maestro man. His fishing and uh, mining could use some work though, but that's fine. 169 efficiency. Not that good, but not that bad either. And finally, we have Mr. Baba Papa. He went temporarily back to fishing thanks to an annoying daily. Reeling the hermit crab. Now we can finally continue his soul killing. And let's send him to Pinsamin. I started doing the star signs. I've done three out of eight in world three. We unlocked quite a few things here, but then uh, I stopped doing it. <laughs> I will get back to that eventually because I think some of these are really good. In alchemy, I'm I'm pretty much upgrading a new bubble every day. Just trying to find like super weak bubbles and upgrade them. Like this bubble is really, really good, but I don't have many yellowfish. So level 50 it is. Construction, currently building the undead shrine. That doesn't work, I think. Upgrading the Wither shrine because it's fast and easy. And this one as well. Chest space, 22 out of 25. And we can upgrade the Pantheon Shrine. 36 out of 50. Pulse Mage, 10. Fireball, 16 Boulder, 2 Frozen, 2 Storm Color, 4 Party Starter, 1 Kraken. These are the current cogs. The expiry rate have increased a lot, as everyone is now over level 100, I was gonna say. But Pick an Axe is lazy. How dare you pick an Axe? 
yeah, looking pretty good. I'm XP focused, so everything 33 is the current lowest, so there's a 32. So I replace them every now and then. It's a very tedious system, this. You do it like this. You get a bunch of crap. Did get one good there. But then you have to manually delete all of them. Oh, we got two good. Interesting. Yeah, I can't move you. So we got two upgrades. That was more than usual. That's the recording luck. Anything else? Arcade. I got two hundred balls again. Post office. Let's keep working on this, I guess. This guy have 127 balls to use. Uh, not balls, upgrades. He has maxed out fishing. Not sure what to use him for now. He has 200 in this one. Guess he could get some more damage to him. Or maybe the printer sample size. Not sure at all. Other than that, I got all the cars maxed out pretty much, except the crystal ones and the wooden mushroom. Hmm. Oh, except the void and the cinder forge and the silo bone and the crystal cattle and the pingy and the bunny and the rooted soul and dungeon barely any. I did get this one from a card pack. It was nice. It's one of the better one than dungeon credit, but I never use them. All the bosses maxed out. I have not done the chaotic version yet. I'm trying to get a bit more damage before that happens. Not sure what happened with Valentine. I think it started really late last year, like 24, February 24. So we shall see if it comes out. Currently 22 as I'm recording this. I did not do this event last year. I started right after the Easter event. So the summer event was my first one. And yeah, I think that's everything. Since we are here, let's actually fix this a bit. There we go. Trash the rest. So yeah, you make such tiny progress every day. Like maybe every day you place one or two cogs. You have a rank, uh, rank 10, I guess that says. Yeah, I think I got the achievement recently. Rank up redox, combustion refinery to chamber rank 10. You should always rank up your red salt. These are mainly up to you. So rank 10, 7, 5, 4, and 3. This one is not unlocked. 3D printing, barely touching it. Even though maybe I should focus more on it, but oh well. I finally got the last upgrade in the salt lake now with the pingies. Hey, we got 1% total damage now. Hooray. Finally, let's check out the kill count here. Most of them are blue skull, red mushroom, giga frog and poop, rat and walking stick. Plenty of kills. Mafioso, yeah, I haven't farmed them a lot at all. Tons of snappy kills, 8 million. Not bad. And finally here, only 1.2 million RAM. Yeah, so most of them are blue skull at least. I need to fix these guys and especially these ones. I guess I can just take away the Snellby farmers and put them on sand giants instead. So that's pretty much what I've been doing since last month. I've been saying this in a few videos now, but I'm pretty much only waiting for the next world. I'm not playing much Eidolon anymore. Well, I mean, I play it every day, but I log out pretty quickly because I want that quality of life. And the main thing I have left to do is things that takes a lot of micro to do. Anyway, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.